Look, I think it all um, started about 28 years ago. We were looking for a traditional hills home and the, uh, we had an agent looking for us and he rang me and he said, you need to have a look at this. It's everything you didn't ask me to find for you. And we came up and uh, it was an eight square log cabin and uh, you pass the house and the view was spectacular. It was just, it just magical really. And it was, it, it, we fell in love with it straight away and we had to have it. Uh, so when we, we had this log cabin, we knew that we were going to do multiple extensions and, and changes to it to make it capitalise on that view, and that's what we've done. So we've uh, incorporated a huge span of glass windows at every opportunity, so that we, well, no matter what room you're in, you have to look out and you, you will see that view in front of you. And it's something that you, you know, it's every, basically every part of the house is, is focusing on the view. It is spectacular. When people walk in through the front door and they enter the main living area, they always stop and look at it. And that's the first thing people focus on. And it's hard to draw them away from it. And that's, I guess, the, uh, the beauty of the place and the key attraction. The colours change all the time. You can have a hazy day or it's all quite grey. And the next minute it's a bright blue colour. The water's blue, the next minute it's green. Uh, something that's really special is if you see a storm coming through, it, uh, it changes everything. And you see this cloud and this rain these rains clouds starting to approach you and you know you've got about 15 or 20 minutes before it hits and it is spectacular to watch. So the property itself, uh, a lot of it's clear paddocks, so we've got large paddocks there where you can run horses, cows, sheep, whatever you'd like to do on there. Uh, we have two creeks on the property as well. Uh, in those creek areas there's lots of tree ferns and natural habitation down there. Uh, you'll see wombats walking around, especially at night. We have wallabies, there's some deer there. Uh, wombats are the, uh, the specialty there. You can see them walking across your backyard. Uh, that, that happens on a regular basis. It's, it's time now for us to move on and I think it's, it's an opportunity for another family or other people to come and enjoy what we've had here. Uh, will we miss it? Absolutely. I mean, this is a lifestyle. Uh, where we're situated, we've got full access to the city, so we can be in the hustle and bustle within minutes. But you drive up the hill and you come back to this place and all of a sudden you've got this serenity and this calming aspect that is just a great break from what is normally a hectic city life. It'll be hard to find something to replace this with, uh, but I think it's time for us now to, to move on to something different and somebody else to take up the mantle and enjoy what we've had for so many years.